Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial on this look right here. And it is using... Let me get it out. It's going to be using some amazing products from the brand ColourPop. It's using the Super Shock Shadows in the shade Weenie and Cricut. And then their Ultra Matte Lips uh, in the shade Trap. These products are amazing. They're great and extremely affordable. They're like, what, like six six dollars don't quote me on that because i don't know for sure anyway i hope you guys enjoy the video and thumbs up comment below subscribe do all that jazz and i'll see you in my next video i don't even know what i just said so i just primed my eyes with the urban decay it's just the original primer primed my eyes already and i thought i'd hit record but i didn't but this is what i used Okay, so first we're going to go in with the shade Mauve. This is in the Lorac Pro Palette. Oh. And we are going to use it as a transition shade. And so just with any fluffy brush you have, blending brush, just put it right in there. Okay, now in the same Lorac Pro Palette, we're going to go in with the shade Espresso. And we're going to focus just directly in the crease not very high just keeping it very low and also with the same espresso color just kind of i'm just going to kind of bring it down a little on the outer corner just to give the other shade that i'm going to put in the outer corner just to make it a little bit darker have more depth i don't know but you know what i mean okay now we are going to go in with ColourPop Super Super Shock Shadow in the shade Cricut. I dropped it last night, so it's a little bit broken on the edge. But it's just a nice... Mm, right there. It's like purple, but not purple. Kind of brown. Some glitter in it. We're going to take some. We're going to put it on the outer corner. Now we are going to go in with ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in the shade Weenie. This is like the best color ever. It's so pretty. It's like a rose gold kind of color. We're just going to pack this on our lid. Okay, and then we're going to go in with the, what is this, Morphe Eyeshadow in the shade Silk. I don't know if you can see it. We're just going to put this under the brow. Okay, then I'm going to go on with the shade Porcelain from Morphe. Just hitting it right at the arch of the brow. Then I'm going to go on with the shade Crystal by Morphe as the inner corner highlight. Then I'm going to go in with the shade Coal by Morphe and put it on the bo bottom lashes, lower lashes, whichever one works for you. Where'd the brush go? I'm just going to put it right in the outer corner. Then we're going to go back in with the shade Mauve that we use for our transition color to buff out the lower lash line so it's not so harsh. Now we're going to go in with eyeliner. We're going to use the Maybelline geez, Gel Eyeliner in the blackest black. I'm going to start out by just lining the lash line. Okay, and then for the wing, we're going to start on the outer corner and work the brush up to the end of our eyebrow. Couldn't get my thoughts straight. Okay, now you're just going to fill it in. We're going to smudge out, smudge, that's just a weird word, the outer corner with the same gel. I just used a different brush. 
Okay, then I'm gonna go in with the L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. Then I'm gonna go in with the Urban Decay Provision Mascara. <coughs> oh my gosh. Then we're gonna go in with the Maybelline uh, Mascara, just in the pink bottle for the lower lashes. Now for the brows, I'm going in with the Anastasia Brow Wiz in the shade Soft Brown, but I'm gonna skip over the this step just for time purposes. And now my brows are done. If only it was that quick. Then we're gonna go in with the Jaclyn Hill Palette Face Palette. All right, we're gonna go in with this shade right here. And then for a highlight, we're going to use both Champagne Pop and Prosesco Pop. I just sneeze. <coughs> oh, bless me. And then I'm going to put a little teensy bit of Champagne Pop right on like the tip of my nose. And then on my cupid's bow too. And then we're gonna go in with ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in the shade Trap. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of the highlighter and just put it on the center of my bottom lip just to give it a little bit more pop and to make it my lips look a little fuller. And then we're going to set our face with the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. Alright guys, that is it for this makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you on my next video. Mwah. Bye!